Hey y'all, welcome back to another video. Got a good one for y'all. It is a monthly or our monthly huge grocery haul and the budget flew the coop on this one. Um, I don't know what happened. It's soup season. Um, I don't have anything for soups, so I had to get a bunch of canned goods and things like that. We were running kind of low on um, chicken in our deep freeze, so I added some of that to our Costco list and just a bunch of random stuff. And it all unfortunately just adds up. I'm not that far off my budget, but I'm not super happy with it, so. I'm going to have to tame myself. I went over by like $100 last month, but still doing better than we were. And that's literally all that matters. So nonetheless, um, it's also my birthday month. So maybe I was feeling a little, you know, whatever. I don't know. <laughs> so we are going to Costco today. And then this will be like a little two-part type video because... <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Ellie. <laughs> Um, I'm going to go to Costco today. So <laughs> got distracted. This is going to be like a little two part video. Um, I'm going to go to Costco today, do a haul with that. And then I have a Walmart pickup tomorrow afternoon, um, because I did it too late. So I couldn't pick it up today. So, um, I will leave the number on the screen because I just don't want it to come out of my mouth because anyways, uh, <laughs> Um, but I also, so, um, we just got home from church. It's Sunday today and we get home from church and our house is a disaster, disaster. Our pup had managed to get out of his kennel and get into everything. I will leave the footage here next. Um, y'all, I like, I'm, I'm not okay. At, like I have to throw my sourdough away. I've worked well over three months on that. Not like it was perfect, but it was on its way to getting mature. Um, and he managed to get up on the counter and bring it down and was like licking all inside of it. So it is contaminated and it is no longer good. Um, so I am very sad about that. Um, but nonetheless, it was funny. And despite that and like one other thing, he actually did very well and didn't like completely destroy everything in the house. Like it could have been a hundred times worse for a puppy being completely free in the house for well over an hour. So, um, but let's go ahead, get into this video. Um, I wish I could take y'all along with me to Costco, but it's Sunday. It's probably very busy there and I'm going to have the kids with me. So unless I can convince Mark to come, I don't know if I'll get any footage of it, but let's go. Oh, <laughs> by the way, Hey y'all, I'm Kate, stay at home mom of two. If you are new to the, if you are new to this channel, I try to give cleaning motivation, day in the life type stuff, monthly grocery hauls, um, and just, you know, random things thrown in here and there because that's motherhood and life. And, um, yeah, I just kind of really stick to one thing anyways. Um, but please subscribe if you have not subscribed already and let's get into the video. <laughs> Wow, this is a big giant mess. It is a big giant mess. Here, look, 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 look. You got sourdough on your head there, Kip. Did you have your fun of freedom? Did you have a fun time? Did you get out of your kennel? Oh my gosh.
giant pile behind me of things to show y'all. Um, I went to Costco and then I ended up going to Sam's. I wasn't planning on it, but Costco was completely out of water. Um, and I didn't know if the apocalypse was coming because then we stopped at Sam's and everybody was coming out of Sam's Club with like a minimum of four cases of water. <laughs> it was, Mark thinks I'm lying. I am not lying. So I ended up getting three cases of water. Whatever, we'll drink it. You can never not like have enough water. So um, let's get into this haul and show you everything I got. All right, first up is paper towels. Gotta put those over there somewhere. Um, we are trying this for the first time, but my kids love bacon and I don't love cooking bacon every day. So we are gonna give this. You asked me this last time. Yes, I am. Um, so we're gonna try this, and then I got some more ground. You just and you just gonna make a bunch of noise back there. Is that what you're gonna do? <laughs> and the dog. Are y'all in coats? Hey, some ground beef and some chicken breasts. Um, got some bread for the kids. I think they ran through bread this past month, and I think it's because our daughter's on a peanut butter and jelly kick. Oh my gosh, excuse you. And then I got some sourdough because since I have to start my sourdough starter over again, I um, had to buy some sourdough and some flour. And then we got some pretzel crisps. And these, these are not as good as the late July, but they didn't have those. Um, cause I saw last time they were, it had like the asterisk, so they were running out of them. Um, so we got these and then we got honey crisp apples because they are superior to regular apples. Some 
Um, I also got some tuna. I've really been liking this for lunches lately. I add a little bit of shredded carrots and some cucumber and everything seasoning and buffalo sauce and then eat it with uh, the pretzel crisp and it's so good. Um, we got two things of bananas and then some breakfast chicken sausage. They had these there for the first time and I was so excited because these are my favorite breakfast sausages and then I got Mark's favorite breakfast sausages some salami because this stuff is so good so we got two of them because my son loves having this in his lunch for school and then we got the turkey breast the oika okay this video is a hot mess y'all it is insanely crazy around here but I got the oikos triple zero um, yogurt and then the stony feel little yogurt pouches. I thought the kids would like that for, um, I don't know, just like a quick breakfast or something and my son's lunch. Then of course cottage cheese and then I got some Mexican cheese. Okay. And then we got these to try. I saw these new at Costco, um, and I've been hearing really good things about them. So got that to try for lunches, quick dinners, whatever, some mango chunks. These were also new for us. I don't know if they're new at Costco or not, uh, but these look good and they come in for individual pouches, which is really nice. I'm gonna try them in the air fryer though, cause we don't have a microwave. Um, <laughs> yeah, we, we haven't had a microwave in like two years, but um, we make do. And then of course I got this for the kids. It's their absolute little favorite. Um, and then I saw these at Sam's Club, which I love built bars and I haven't tried the like puffs yet, um, but it's the churro puff and brownie batter puff and then you get an extra double chocolate. Um, so these are nice. I'm not a big like sweet tooth person, but when I do, it's nice to just go to this and it's got the protein. So all in all, pretty good. Um, and then got some peanut butter. So like I said, they've been running through peanut butter and jelly sandwiches lately. Some butter and then some fish oil for the dogs. Actually, this is for the dogs. Um, and then some immune gummies because I swear it's like since my kids started school, they have just been like getting sick non-freaking-stop. Non-stop. And then also this, which they had this and this on sale. And these were on sale for for I want to say like $11, which like one of these is $8. So it's a total deal. You get two of the daytimes and one of the nighttimes, which is perfect because we actually only have one of the daytimes left and I still have like two of the nighttimes. So it all works out. <gasps> Paisley? All right, and then, you know, we live in dog care, so of course I had to stock back up on these because we were running low and then two things of eggs because we just go through eggs a lot in this house and then some jet dry this was on sale as well some pouches some cow fare. and then they had this on sale because they're getting rid of it um and it was on sale for 24 dollars, which is crazy because it's originally like 41 or something like that or 37 i don't know i can't remember um but my son does not like this, but my daughter does. And we still have some of the chocolate up on top of our fridge. So I was like, it'll just make both of these last longer, splitting them. And then I got th these were from Sam's because Costco was out. So I got three of them, which I like priced it. Like if I would have got two at Costco or three there, cause these are 12 packs. Um, it's about the same price. And then our three things of water, which probably is a little extreme, but you know, it is what it is. So this is everything. Um, the grand total, I really don't want to say out loud if I'm being honest, but um, I'm pretty sure between Sam's Club and Costco, it was like $600. I feel like it's not even that much either. Like that's what's insane to me. So I feel like it's not even that much food. And then I have my Walmart pickup order tomorrow, which was also quite pricey. Like I said, the budget just went out the window this month. I, I don't know what's wrong with me. Um, so I will see y'all back here tomorrow for the Walmart haul, but in your case, like literally a second. So, all right, y'all, it is the next day. Um, I worked this morning and then went and picked Carter up from school, 
did the Walmart pickup, got everything inside. So I'm gonna give you this little haul real quick. I am so tired. I wanna try to get a workout in, but I'm not sure it's gonna happen and that's okay. But let's get this Walmart order done. I'm a little disappointed because they like literally just like threw everything into my car and some stuff is like damaged. Some stuff is not what I ordered. So I don't know. This one was definitely kind of weird. Um, but nonetheless, everything is here. Um, so let's see what we got. I, I'm out of breath. All right, y'all, we're just going to start over here. So I got some plates. I didn't want to get like a whole crap ton from Costco. So I just got these ones. Um, and then I got two of these because this is what I use for our granola and then some uh, cocoa powder because we were all out. And then I got these, which these are really weird because they're all like one, like it's not, I don't know, super, like it's one hard chunk. It's really weird. Both of them are like that. So it like, it melted and then... I don't know, whatever. Um, some Ritz crackers for the kids' lunch and just to have. Same with some graham crackers, some more jam, some mini pretzels. Um, and then I got some hamburger buns and some frozen beef patties because our son loves cheeseburgers but i mean we don't make cheeseburgers every single night so it's like i'm just gonna go ahead and get these to heat up quickly for him if he wants one and then some french fries of course and some wild blueberries i've um, got a bunch of canned goods for soups and chilies and whatnot we got black beans red kidney beans um some green chilies cannellini beans um is like rotel basically uh some diced tomatoes and then this version of that like this um and then some tomato sauce got some grapes which i don't know these look kind of sketch but we'll see how they are strawberries um avocado shredded carrot some mini cucumbers some whole carrots. This is what I've gotten two of these, but they gave me one of these. So I don't know. Um, some dark chocolate hummus. The kids love this stuff. Um, some cheese, cream cheese. One's for soup, one's for when I make protein bagels. Some this yogurt. I thought this looked good. Mark's eat, <laughs> Mark eats yogurt like almost every day for lunch or breakfast. Um, so I get him the yogurt cups, but then I figured for him to try this just for some extra protein. And then I got this for myself. It's just like a little snack or something just to get some extra protein. Some Fairlife lactose free milk. Some root beer zero. I have been like obsessed with this stuff. I know it's not the most healthiest thing. But it is what it is. It's all about balance. Some juice boxes for the kids. Got the Roaring Waters and the Honest. Again, all about balance. Um, and then the Paw Patrol, the animals, and then like the Disney the animals and that was everything and again i feel like i did not even get that much and all of this was like 172 um this is expensive i mean these blueberries were super expensive so but here's everything uh, most of this should last us like well over the month so i think we're good here okay y'all so here i am thinking i was videoing when i was putting all this stuff away I, however, was not. So here's how I put everything away. Um, we have a lot of yogurt. Like, good Lord. I'm surprised we don't have more digestive issues with all this dairy. We <laughs> uh, but yeah, these are the kids' little yogurt things, the turkey, these new little things I got, which I'm about to have one right now. Um, and then obviously the eggs and the danimals, the peanut, uh, Perfect bars, apples. Um, this was a whole bunch of meat Mark cooked up last night. Um, so that's everything. And then, oh, I also got this stuff to try, the Modere. I finally broke down 
and tried it because y'all my hair just is not growing it's just not growing um so i caved and we're trying this and then here's our pantry pretty much looks the exact same <laughs> um i just forget i need to get some cereal but that's whatever and that's i mean like i do need to get it because our son eats cereal like it's going legitimately out of business there's all the water and the juice boxes um snacks crackers the pretzels and the graham crackers um so that's pretty much everything i also figured i would show y'all i'm starting my sourdough over um so we'll see how that goes i fed it last night okay baby go ahead i fed it last night and so basically how it goes to do a sourdough starter maybe like maybe this is a good thing i can like take y'all along the journey with me to show y'all how to like do a sourdough starter from the beginning maybe i'll just make that a whole separate video but really quick um um hold on baby okay really quick is basically i'm gonna have to like re-look it up again but i'm 90 percent sure it's you feed it every yes but put it back okay because you're not gonna have it right now you can look at it yeah uh every 24 hours you feed it so i started with 50 grams of flour all-purpose unbleached organic flour and 50 grams of warm water um and so i did that and then for the first four days you just add in another 50 grams so tonight i'll add in another 50 grams of flour and 50 grams of water and you just repeat that and then um after four days then you discard and you leave about 25 grams left and then you just start that process all over again of just like adding in 50 grams so um like i said maybe i'll just like this will be the start of like how to do a sourdough starter from the beginning um and i can just like film that process for y'all so that way if anybody is learning how to or wants to learn how to make a sourdough starter from somebody who does not know how to make a sourdough starter and just yeah and just like learned along the way i'm your girl so yeah maybe we'll try that all right y'all that's gonna wrap up this a video i hope y'all enjoyed this one i was glad i was able to like take y'all along to costco with me this time i just blew a bubble with my spit i don't know if you saw that <laughs> anyways um so i hope y'all liked it it was definitely weird i feel like people were staring at me even though they probably weren't because i feel like everyone and their mom like vlogs nowadays <laughs> um so i feel like having your phone up but it was like really busy so maybe that's why people are staring at me like girl come on um but anyways i hope y'all enjoyed this video if you have not subscribed already please do and hit that like button if you liked this stuff so i can create more for you um i'm trying to think of some videos some upcoming videos i'm gonna have for y'all comment below if there's anything you guys like want to see i definitely feel like y'all like the clean with me more and it's definitely forcing me to clean more um i'm definitely gonna get better at doing these outros in the sense that i always actually forget to do them um, like it'll be like I'll like do everything I need to do and I'm like, oh my gosh I forgot to film the outro. Or I just forgot to film this this and this so When I do my clean with me because that's life like that's how it is around here where I'll like film and do some things and then we I get sidetracked and we go and do something somewhere or get the kids like get the kids ready for bed and then it's like the next day or two days later and then I finally get back to doing it so I'll get better y'all I promise but comment down below what y'all want to see and as always if y'all need some prayers if you need some support please comment down below I love y'all I appreciate y'all and I'm praying for y'all so I hope you have a blessed day and I'll see y'all in the next one